Trickers, Anthony Medina here, and today we're going to be doing the first tutorial on the novice set of moves, the spinning hook kick. So I'm just going to go ahead and split this move on the steps to hopefully help you guys out a little bit more to make it a little bit easier for you guys. Alright, let's get it in. Step one is going to be the cheat setup. Looks like this. Here, over. Super easy. Now for the cheat setup, you want to make sure your arms are straight out and not bent in. This will help you gain momentum. Also, when you step over, you want to make sure that your legs are close together and not spread apart. This will keep your center of gravity and make it easier to throw the kick. Alright guys, so step two is going to be throwing the actual kick. A lot of people get this confused though at first because instead of kicking from corner to corner, they just kick it straight back and they eliminate a lot of the exaggeration of the hook. So let me go ahead and break that down for you real quick. For your upper body, you're going to be bringing your arms in slightly and dipping one shoulder. At the same time, you're going to be looking over your opposite shoulder to spot your kick. Now when you throw the kick, you want to make sure that it's coming up from the side and it's not coming straight back behind you. That way you can show more of the exaggeration of the full hook kick. Alright, now we're just putting step one together with step two to get a clean, nice hook kick. Once you put these steps together properly, you should be able to come out nice and smooth. It's going to take practice though, so don't forget that. So that's it guys, a spinning hook kick tutorial. If you guys have any questions on this move, just send me a message in my inbox or leave me a comment and I'll get back to you. I just want to thank everyone so much for subscribing. Happy holidays. Keep tricking. Peace out, guys.